your lovely clothes. Claire and Lindsay. <laughs> Claire, <laughs> Lindsay having her hair done. This is yes, a, I do. This thank is a you. movie. <laughs> lovely. This is Claire's table, all her implements. I wouldn't be able to do it if not for the start. Oh, so I'm going to Sue, is that your little card over here? Yes, poor oh. little thing. I'm just saying, I'm crunching all the way around thinking, oh, get there. <laughs> <laughs> My hair don't curl very well, either. Yeah. Just thought I'd warn you. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> well, normally, I'd give somebody if you struggle with a, a wet set. Yeah. That's what I have to do on mine, because mine pogs straight. looks like an 80s wig. Yeah. So, uh, is it mine that is Actually, while you're here as well, I will show you what for me. Now, to make sure these are secure, these little prongs are great. You want to go in across the grips you've already done. So it knits in. So you can see that they knit in. Like if do any ladies do a French pleat? Mm -hmm. Same pr process basically, just on a smaller scale. And we can close them in. And then the thing that drives me insane the most when I'm out and about are things not closing the back of your roll. I remember my nan telling me they were ladies like ankle bracelets, mate, and they were whores to her. <laughs> it was a lady who stood at the bar who had an ankle bracelet and the back of a roll not closed in. Mm -hmm. She couldn't cope with it. So you just put your comb in and pull. And you'll see that shape that one of your little prongs again just closes it down. Always smoothing with your hairspray. Just the yeah. No, not in American would have, but British. Um, they used to make a mixture of quince seeds mixed with water and put them in, in atomizers and also on their hands to, to use it. My nan used to use a lot of quince. And but she did get, if you could get hold of hairspray, but not really until the late 40s, very late 40s. And then in the 50s, it obviously exploded. That's why if you haven't got, if you don't want to, if you want to be really authentic, use the pomade, because they would have got hold of pomade. They use the man's stuff. And then you do the same thing. You just warm it and smooth it. Then you put a towel on your head, warm towel, and let it set. And it all, but the quince seed made it. That was it. You couldn't. My, my nan said she could get about two weeks out of her hair if she did that, because it literally was like a little helmet. She said it was great for cycling, because she always felt safe. Because if she did, <laughs> if she had to curb, she'd be fine. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't fancy boiling up quince seed for you. <laughs> so yeah, we're just taking the comb, and you just give it a little push. And that will close the back one. There you go. Thank you very much. Let's take that nice out. And I just, because this lady has a fringe, so I've just done a little curl on the fringe as well. So this was going with the curling tongs. So if you've got any little bits, curling tongs good for that. But trying to do your whole hair with the curling tongs, virtually impossible on yourself unless you're very dexterous and have a best off hands because you're going to burn yourself go do the big reveal <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why you can do that. Back on hold. 
hold on. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> well, done. And I did a. Ta -da. Ta -da. Yeah, feels very secure. Do you want to look now? Yeah, that's right. Oh, my word. <laughs> <laughs> I look like my grandma. <laughs> <laughs> that's kind of what I'm doing yeah. to you. Yeah. <laughs> but also, ladies, if you do want to hold it and you feel like your hair's not, it's a trusty hair now